Okay, sure. Uh, may you please say your name for the recording? Uh, my name is Jenna Prandini. So Jenna, can you walk me through the race today? Um, yeah, uh, the race plan was just to get out hard and run the first 150 hard and then uh, kind of see where I'm at and relax and just finish the race. I have a question from Chris Hansen. Mm -hmm. uh, he asks, did you feel ready uh, to PR in the prelims? Um, I mean, my practices have, have been going really, really well. Um, and my coach has been telling me that I'm ready to run fast. So I'm happy that I'm putting it together at the right time. And um, I got to make it to this semis tomorrow and um, be ready to go on Friday because I know there's a lot of good people. Uh, Tom Baines from Northwest Public Broadcasting asks, Jenna, the National Weather Service. Uh, excuse me, Jenna, can you just hold the mic just a little oh. bit more to the corner? This way? Yeah. Thank you. Gotcha. Sorry about that. He asks, Jenna, the National Weather Service is describing the high temps in the forecast for this weekend as dangerously hot. How do you feel about the racing how, how do you feel about the race seat in such conditions? Um, I'm from Clovis, California, so summertime was always like that. Um, the temperatures were hot, and I don't know how many times I've ran in that hot weather, but um, and it's nothing that bothers me, and just got to stay hydrated. And then Chris Hansen asks, uh, uh, what did you do between Saturday's 100 final and tonight to get ready? Um... A lot of recovery with um, my doctor out here and um, just a little bit on the, the track to shake out my legs. And then um, I'm staying with some of my training partners. So we just kind of keep each other in good spirits and I have my family in town. So um, I really have everything I need to be successful here. I have a question from Doug Binder. How encouraging was it to be out so fast and be able to shut it down and still get 22.14? Um, I'm really encouraged by it. Uh, the plan was just to get out there and execute the first 150 and then just stay relaxed. So um, I did that well, and I'm just excited to see what comes. I have a question from Travis from Coin6 Portland. Are you doing anything out of the ordinary to prepare for this weekend's heat wave? Out of the ordinary? No, just uh, making sure I'm hydrating and um, staying cool. Uh, I'm, I'm kind of used to this because I grew up in it, so um, it doesn't really bother me at all. Okay, I just want to remind the media, if you have any questions, please raise your hand emoji and so I know you're typing anything. <laughs> Okay, Jenna, it looks like there are no more We're good. Questions. We're all good. Thank cool, you so much.